Hi, everybody. This is Randy Suits with a letter and a song. Our letter for 26 May is the first of a four-part series called Good, Better, Best, and Sublime. And this is part one. My darling Eve. And the devil and his angels said, but the love of this couple is blessed and ordained by the Most High and cannot be destroyed by angels or demons, said the conspirator. But we must stop them, for the success of their mission is the destruction of our cause, replied another. They must be discouraged, harassed, tormented, confused, and separated said the lowest of the low. For if only one of them can be dissuaded, we will postpone our certain doom. For if he won't reject her, then she must be coerced to reject him. His father chose his bride. He prophesied in the ears of witnesses and infiltrators, yet a little while, and he who is to come will come. Yet a little while, and she who can come through will come through. He might be one of the promised conquerors. If so, time is short. We must act now to prevent this union. They will be formidable in the Father with their full authority. From such powerful love as this springs forth restoration of the lost estate from man. Then the lowest of the low concluded, he is protected and hedged about by the love of his father and won't move out from under the protective umbrella of the promise. He is immovable in his decision to stand by the woman who the Most High God has chosen for him. For it is required that both husband and wife must be chosen by the Father. If we allow this union, the promised one will surely come. His wife has become the good, better, best, and sublime in his life. We must work to cause her to become the bad, worse, worst, and abominable to him. And we can only do that through her yours in the mysteries of promise for his children. Many mysteries have been held until the end, but God knows what he's doing. And uh, so does the devil. He knows what's about to come about. And he doesn't know just how God's going to work. But you see, God is God. He cannot fail. And the most low, even Lucifer, he is a failure already from the beginning when he rebelled against God. He was a failure. And so tonight, we're going to do one of my favorite songs here. This is a song of love in the chapel in the moonlight. How I love to hear the organ In the chapel in the moonlight While we're strolling down the aisle Where roses entwine How I love to hear you whisper chapel in the moonlight that the love light in your eyes forever will shine till the roses turn to ashes till the organ turns 
If you never come, I'll still be there Till the moonlight turns to dust How I love to hear the choir In the chapel in the moonlight As they sing, oh, promise me Forever be mine Till the roses turn to ashes Till the organ turns to rust If you never come I'll still be there Till the moonlight turns to hear the choir in the chapel in the moonlight as they sing oh promise me forever be mine and that's how true love is isn't it we take a vow before God and man, and we promise our love in all faithfulness and in holiness, righteousness, and truth. And so let's give thanks for the God who not only created us, but had the perfect plan for us and who will most certainly Restore man to the original plan in the beginning. And now, my dear friends, may the Lord, even the Most High God, be with you in all that you think, say, do, and are. Thank you for being. And God willing, we'll see you again soon.